I've struggled with writing so much that I missed that one. It's a writer's block, not a roadblock. I wrote road, roadblock down. And uh, happy birthday over there, by the way. Whose is it? John? Is your name John? Holy shit, happy birthday, John. Jack, I knew they'd call you Jack. The interesting birthday, 11-11, make a wish. Interesting wish from your parents. Um, this month is all about veterans, right? And like, no shave November. I don't, why does everything have to have a theme now? October is the pink, the breast cancer. November, uh, every Sunday, there's camouflage at the, sun, at the football games. Everything we're celebrating, even uh, uh, Halloween was celebrated October 23rd and 24th in Trolley. It was the week before. What are we going to start never forgetting on September 4th? I don't get it. <laughs> like, let's... The day is the day. Why are we pre-gaming holidays? Because we're white and we have nothing else to do. <laughs> There's the answer. Uh... What do you guys think about Missouri, the university? Uh, Want to clap it up for that? I don't know. Woo! It took a second. It, uh, it's funny because the football team just said we're not going to play football, and the guy was like, oh, shit. We're, they're not going to play football? We're going to lose a lot of money. We are racist. We all quit. Let's get on with it. <laughs> we got that football team out there. I bet if the uh, dance team protested, it was like, we're not going to dance anymore. The administrator would be like, okay, you have jazz hands, fuck off, Chris. You're fucking, like, okay, like, go back to work. The football team does it, oh my god. When I wrote that, I was going to say, uh, for the, one of the dancers, his name was going to be Marquise, but I did my research, he's on the football team. Everyone relax. He's a freshman running back, he's having a solid year. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. I, um... Go to the start. I started doing stand up because uh, I, I, in college, I went to West Virginia. I tried to set a couch on fire because that's good. I, that's like a thing they do there couch burning to celebrate wins. And I didn't even get the couch lit. That's how retarded I am. And uh, but I realized I wanted to do stand up because I had to speak to 10 university one on one classes after that. And I was like, oh, I'm kind of good at this. And I, I stuck with I made some people laugh. I did talk in front of them, so I liked it. You know, I was thinking, what if I went and did more of a heinous crime, like a hit and run? I was in like jail, you know. I was I was raped in jail, and then I, I'm like, I, but I was into it, so then I was like a gay porn star, you know. Just, <laughs> just uh, realize your opportunities and assess them. I've ruined your birthday party. I'm sorry, John. <laughs> Johnny's birthday party. It's a good alibi. Where were you tonight, Max? It was a John's birthday party. It was, it was lit. We had a lot of pizza and tinfoil, I see, over there. Let's make a bowl out of that later. I, I don't really have a closer. Fenris is over here. He's, he's going on tonight. You're yeah, very excited. I wrote Roadblock earlier, Fenris. I told you this. What's up with Greg Hardy? What do you guys think about Greg Hardy? Clap it up for Greg Hardy. There's... <laughs> I thought you guys were deaf and a robot, but there's the answer. That might be correct. You know, Greg Hardy made everyone take the side of a woman... Uh, she was a bartender who he beat up. It rarely happens. If she wasn't beat up by Greg Hardy, a lot of people would be bitching at her because she's a slow bartender or something. I don't know. But if you get beat up by a football player, 100% of the country has your back. Okay, I'm Max Gallo. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. You guys are a great crowd. Let's give it up for your host, Kevin Hoofy. It's a Hoofy party. Also, John, happy birthday. <laughs>